All right, here we go. I'm trying to return to doing videos using English. Uh, I know not everybody is learning Spanish or interested in Spanish. I try to use it because it's like, like so fun to speak two different foreign languages in one video. But I'm going to get back to it, man. I'm studying Chinese heavy again. I'm also studying Spanish heavy again. I have some characters here. All these characters have on, on. That character on means peace. I have 18, 18 words here, and I'm just going to talk about them a bit. Uh, hopefully, this will help some people with their basic understanding of Chinese because these are basic characters and words. And also, these are HSK characters. Anybody who's trying to go to China or take the HSK test, it should be of some assistance. I've been working with my editing software. I'm going to try to put the words on, this, on the screen again like I used to. So, starting off. I'm going to try not to be self-conscious about my tones, too. You know, no, it's perfect. Starting off, we have... An Chuan. An Chuan. Basically meaning uh, peace and safety. An meaning peace. Chuan. Totally, complete, everything. So, with everything being at peace, that's peace or safety. Next up we have, we have An Xin, An Xin. Both these characters have that first tone, that high tone. We have An and then we have Xin. Uh, Xin being the heart, El Corazon. So this can mean like to be relieved, for the heart to be at peace, alleviated. That's what this word means. An Xin. An Xi. What, what's, the, what's the tone for Xi? An Xi. An Xi. Which basically means to rest. An meaning peace and Xi meaning to breathe. So. That's one way that the Chinese express simply to rest or take a break. It's just peace and breathe. There you go. It's, it's very simple the way that they put words together in the Chinese language. Gong an. Gong an. Gong an meaning the police. In China, all the police cars, they have these characters on them. You know, gong an. Or in some provinces, it's an gong. But uh, that gong means the public. So, peace for the public. An gong. You'll also see it outside of the police stations in China. Bao an. Bao an. Bao an is, those guys are the security, like a security guard in China. Uh, outside of our gate at university, we had these men who would uh, open and close the gate. And they were basically security guards that were looking over people. Those people are bao an. Bao an, bao meaning to protect, so protect peace. And Chinese awesome. Zao, zao an, zao an. It's like Buenos dias, like good morning. That zao is the morning. So we have zao an, zao an. Uh, you can say that in the morning. Uh, Personally, when I see a Chinese person in the morning, I just say Zhao and I like to I like to dip my head. It, it makes them feel like they should respond and they usually hit me with the Zhao. It's pretty pleasant. Chinese people enjoy that. Wan An. Wan An. Wan An is uh, Buenas Noches. It's like it's like good night. It's like good night. You can say this at nighttime, talking with a Chinese person when you walk up, hit them with the wan on, or they'll probably say it back to you, or uh, before going to sleep, before going to sleep, hit somebody with the wan on, and it makes, basically means for the rest of the night, you know, uh, rest well, sleep well, have a good night. Uh, wan means nighttime. An shun. An shun. 
Anshan. I have it in, I have it written down in Spanish, uh, Refugio, which uh, would seem to be refuge. And this character here, uh, it's, it's this last character here. That's the character for body. So peaceful body, a refuge, a, a safe place to put your body. Safety and then body, refuge, refugio. refugio. Okay, I, I like that. I like that a lot. So that's eight characters right there. Excuse me, eight words. Next up we have on ding on ding excuse me my tone actually on ding on ding uh that ding means to establish like like secure a, a certain place that's not moving it's it's set ding ding so peace that's set you know, set and stable. That's that's how you say stable in Chinese. On ding, it's it's fine. It's it's settled. It's stable. On ding, we have ping on, ping on, meaning safe and peaceful, secure. A ping meaning like level level so a level of a level of peace that means things are secure they're safe it's okay that's a it's an adjective and that's a good adjective ping on we have on jing on jing this is the same jing from gan jing gan jing gan jing means to clean Anjing means peaceful, peaceful. An la, an la. That's how you say Allah, the, the way that Muslim people call, call God, Allah. That's how you say it in Chinese. And there's so many Chinese Muslims, like the Uyghur people, so many Chinese people who are wearing that headdresses and the, you know, Muslim hats. It's a lot of Chinese people. So that's actually an important thing to the Chinese culture. I feel like it's not traditional Han Chinese culture. There's still so many of these people, though, and they have representation in China. An Fang. An Fang. An Fang is to place something. And it comes with the connotation like you're placing something in a place where it will be safe. It will be it's okay to put it there. You have the character for peaceful and then you have the character for put, you know, like to place something down. So if it's, uh, you know, peacefully put, that means, you know, it's going to be safe where you put it and it's okay to place it there. An fang, oliviar, oliviar. Hmm. We have jiao tong an chuan. Jiao Tong An Chuan, which is La Seguridad del Tráfico. Uh, safety, safety in traffic, safety in traffic. Jiao Tong is, you know, is, is the traffic, like literally cars and bikes on the street. Uh, like some people might know the word uh, Jiao Tong Shurgu, a traffic accident. It's that same Jiao Tong traffic Except now we have the An Chuan, which we've already went over in this video. So it's traffic being safe. Jiao Tong An Chuan, the safety of traffic. Tenemos, we have Ching An, Ching An, Ching An being. You can do it as like a greeting. Or even well really really what this word is is it means a greeting or a, a farewell you're you're bidding somebody farewell or you know greeting them Ching meaning please so 
it's, it's in a way it's saying, please be at peace, please be well. Ching An. Uh, I don't think this is so much spoken, but it is like more of a noun for greeting or or a feel, farewell. And then lastly, this is kind of a funny one, we have An Chuan Tao. An Chuan Tao. This word reminds me of the word for gloves. Uh, you know, I had to use gloves in China. It was so cold sometimes with the snow. Uh, the That word is shou tao. Uh, so shou, hand, and then tao is a sleeve or a covering. This word though means condom. Uh, an chuan tao. So we have the an chuan, which means, you know, safety completely. And then we have tao, which means a sleeve. So... You know, uh, keep it safe and, and, and wrap it up. You know, put that sleeve on. That's how you say condom in Chinese. Uh, thank you for the time. I'm going to be ste stepping up my video quality. It's more important for me to do it, though, rather than just talk about it. I'm back studying languages, man. It's 2016. I hope everybody out there is doing good with your language journey. You know, as people in the language game, we should be traveling. We should be using our abilities. We should be getting paid for for what we do. So here's to moving forward. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed.